Hello. I just woke up. <clears throat> and it looks way brighter on the camera than it does out here. It is so cold. So, Sunday, I... I'm like, I'm doing stuff occasionally. Okay. Sunday, I posted a video of my first cigarette of the morning to Patreon uh, for the smoking tier. This is like a bonus video for the month. And it seemed to go over really well. And so I was laying in bed this morning. It's like 7.30. And I was like having a conversation with you in my head. And I was like, I think I'll just get up another, make another first cigarette of the video for the main channel. So I'm out of Monster. And now you see Morning Onesie, which is clearly a disaster. So I literally rolled out of bed. Puffed up. It is colder than balls outside. It feels like 20. Uh, which I don't really get where that expression comes from because balls should stay pretty warm. Isn't that like the whole point of them being able to change their height? So they get regulated. I'm no ball expert. So sorry to reference the Patreon video twice, but something funny happened in the first one that set <clears throat> a couple of particular patrons alight with glee. And I learned something, so I thought I should probably tell you about it. Um, I was talking about how cold it was outside. And I was like, it's, I know it's nothing considered um, compared to like northern places. Like in England, I know it gets super, super cold and Canada and stuff. And I was like, in England, they probably call me, probably be like, that's not cold, you bloody wanker. Or that's not cold, you bloody wanker. <laughs> that's my old woman British accent. That's not cold, you bloody wanker. And apparently, wanker is like a really bad word that you would only really use for a man. And so, one particular British patron lost it, and I love it. Because being American... I didn't realize it was a bad word. It was like a sigh exhale. Well, I, sigh is an exhale, but like, not a usual cigarette exhale. Everyone's going to work. I'm wondering what the hell I'm doing. Good thing I have a... Uh, Oh, nicotine. Anyway, I, I have a... I don't care. So... Where was I going? Oh, yes. I learned that... Uh, learned bollocks is good for everything. Um, bollocks. Bollocks. Probably say it like that. Really pronounce the B. Uh, oh, yeah, I asked what tosser meant. Tosser is kind of middle ground, it seems. But, like, whenever you pretend to be British, <clears throat> as an American, you just throw anchor around. Because that's something they say that we don't say. 
And I had no idea. It was actually a really bad word. Sorry if you're British and I offended you. I'll be sure to use it a lot in Britain. Now I know. It's not just something you uh, toss around like glitter. So, as far as smoking videos go, we have, I'm going to, I'm going to try to figure out how to roll cigarettes. I can just see it going so badly. Just like opening loose tobacco everywhere. That's something I'm going to have to do in the garage. Oh, maybe a will be loose tobacco in there till the end of time. A hundred years. No. Something will get it. Bugged. So I've ever only ever seen like ladybugs and wasps in there. Well, they'd be very interested. Maybe ladybugs. Maybe they'll get a buzz. Fuck. And then Saturday, we're going to do a live stream, which may or may not be at Kelly's house. It's up in the air whether or not I'm going there this weekend. She is um, <clears throat> doing something for work, and it depends on whether or not something happens with her work. But hopefully, that would be nice. Probably won't all be outside. Two hours outside in this. Saturday's actually supposed to be in the 60s. I mean, Friday's supposed to be in the 60s. Saturday's supposed to be in the 50s and raining, but she has her covered porch, so we'll see. I dream like every night and I have this really strange reoccurring dream that I live in this really pretty old mansion that has a very pretty garden in the backyard and it has a manhole in the furthest part of the backyard. And the entire garden has this huge, like, probably a couple of acre bunker underneath it. And it has, like, all these 
stores like um not of like canned goods but like just various old things almost like an antique store and in the back left corner there's a library not a building but like the shelves the entire interior of the library And there's like a colony of adults, weird, I told you it was weird, that live there and uh, maintain the library. And they must, they have like a little garden and they must use like, I mean, there's no sunlight, so grow lights and stuff. And they, um, they almost make enough to be self-sufficient, but they don't quite make enough and so every couple of months I have to give them like rations like give them down like they want to be there I'm not like holding people against their will and uh at some point in the past I forgot that they existed and I didn't give them rations for like a couple of years and so I know they're dead and And one of my past dreams about this, um, like I realized that I forgot about them and I opened the manhole and I'm like, yo, like down the hall, (laughs) no one answers. And so like in every dream since then, it's just like, I know there's a bunker filled with like starved to death librarians, (laughs) um, in my backyard. And I, like, you know, get up to other antics around. But, like, I know that's in the back of my house. Dreams are weird. So I had a dream at that house last night. a lot of reoccurring dreams I guess it's not really a reoccurring dream it's like a layered dream because it's not the same thing every time it's like I pick up at the same location but good morning Normally, when it's this temperature, I'll smoke my first cigarette, like, super, super fast. Get back inside as fast as I can, but... Take my time a little bit with you. It looks so sunny. I'm like, I can't well, but it's so overcast and gray here. It's weird to wake up and make a video. I apologize for my disheveled, disheveled appearance.
can see my breath, but it doesn't seem to be showing up. Too cold. I finish this really fast and go back inside. I just want to touch base with you, and I felt that I hadn't done a smoking video in a while, so I'll see you on Saturday. Thank you. Bye.